people welcome back to the channel guys today we are in the jungle in mexico we just went atv riding and zip lining so i'm dirty but you know i give you my authentic self today my brother is going to ask 10 questions and i'm going to rapidly answer them i have no idea so let's get to this video okay the first question if you weren't a balloon decorator what would you be doing if I wasn't a balloon decorator, I would say that I would be helping out small businesses and helping them grow since I'm so passionate about entrepreneurship. What is the hardest aspect of your business? The hardest aspect of my business is probably working outdoors in the heat since I get migraines a lot. So I would say those outdoor installs on hot days. All right. What do you know now that you wish you knew when you started? that's a good one I would say that I wish I knew that the nine-to-five life is actually easier than being an entrepreneur to be honest <laughs> okay with that what is the main reason you started a business I started it because I've always been passionate about entrepreneurship ever since I was a Girl Scout selling Girl Scout cookies what is your greatest motivation my greatest motivation in life is to challenge myself um, when something seems impossible, I like to challenge myself and figure out how to make it work. Where do you see your business in two years? Ooh, this is a good one. Um, in two years, I see my business branching off into a franchise and we all work together to build Luxie and make it global. What was your most interesting job? That's a good one. My most interesting job was doing a huge balloon wall in the ballroom for the U.S. Chamber of Commerce in Washington, D.C. It was a challenge, something I've never done before, um, and my biggest job. And who was your worst client? Ooh, uh, who's gonna see this video? I would say, uh, I can think of one, but <laughs> I won't say the person's name, but um, sometimes people want small budgets and have high demands and they're very particular. So yeah, it's, it's harder to work with that type of client, but it's possible. Okay. Who would you want to design for? Ooh, an event planner that I really want to work for. Her name is Mindy, Mindy West, and she's in California and she does a lot of jobs with celebrities. Um, I've actually had communication with her, so I look forward to working with her. All right, number 10. Are the long hours and the demanding hours honestly worth it? Are they honestly worth it? I would say yes, because of the fact that in the beginning, you do have to do those long hours and you have to put in a lot of work. There's really no work-life balance, but eventually you can transform your business into being more passive, which I've recently figured out, thankfully. All right, that's 10 questions. Yay, guys. Thank you so much. Thanks to my brother Marcus for these questions. Guys, please be sure to like, comment, and subscribe and let us know if you like this interview. Until next time, good people.